Good evening, everybody. I'm Pierre Roberge, the Daily Trader. It is April 8th. We are going to take a look at uh, Palantir stock. I'm not a financial advisor. I just do technical analysis for fun for myself and I share it with you guys. So um, Palantir, I'm glad to see this uh, closed at 23.41, up 51 cents, uh, up 2.23 percent. Uh, post market down two cents. Uh, looking at the chart here, uh, well, we see that basically Palantir bounced on support. So we have had this big support line that uh, lasted for a while since uh, since last November. So the stock has respected that uh, support line a lot. And there is a mini uh, support line here. I'm going to make it uh, green. There's a mini one here just for fun. You know, it doesn't make much difference, but basically the stock, uh, the stock has had a hard time going under 2274 uh, for the past five days. So, uh, so there's a mini support here. I'm just going to draw it for fun. Um, but uh, really uh, it's just for fun. So, what I see here today is uh, the candle of today is uh, a hammer. So basically the stock went down and then uh, finished up. So uh, this is positive. If I go in the one hour chart and start at 9.30. So 9.30 we had this open here. So the stock had opened here at, at 9.30. Then during the hour went down to this point here then did a little wick down here and then the next hour boom and then quite a strong uh, green candle here and then tried to inch up a little bit and uh, was kind of rejected a little bit here so uh, it encountered a small resistance uh, around this point here at 23. nothing major nothing major so uh, basically the conclusion here is that the stock is uh, respecting our um, green support and uh, quite strongly, you know, because it could have went down and went very close to it, but no, it uh, it stayed quite strongly above it. So I like to see that. Stochastic is at 38, uh, nothing to write mom about, to write to mom about. Uh, Magdi is still, uh, yeah, it's still bullish. Still bullish, DMI is still bearish, so uh, nothing, nothing else to mention about that. Uh, we are going to be needing some major news so that the stock moves. Uh, but until then, the stock is very is is very happy not not to go down our support at uh, twenty two fifty six. As I was mentioning on my uh, Tesla video, um, you can buy Palantir now. You know, if you are not in Palantir, you can buy it now because it has bounced on uh, support. So uh, the support is really there to stay until for a while. And uh, you can buy uh, Palantir now. So it would be a it would be an entry that is low risk because if you buy Palantir now, you can put your stop right underneath uh, this uh, double support at uh, 2113. So you could put the stop just below. And if something bad happens to uh, the stock, you sell when it comes down here. Um, I like to wait for the three indicators to be positive because when the three indicators are positive it means that the stock is going to make a significant move as i mentioned in my tesla video um, looking at the tesla chart um, if we transpose that here you know you could have bought after this candle here you could have bought it here and then made this little swing but uh, this is this is hard work to find these these uh, little swings. So this is why I am waiting for the three indicators to all agree to uh, catch a significant swing. So this is the philosophy behind 
my way of trading. So you can have a, a different way, that's perfectly fine. And I'm not here to give you any financial advice, I'm just telling you what I think. So uh, happy with today's uh, move in Palantir. Thank you for watching, thank you for subscribing, liking, commenting. We have a discount, a discount. We have a Discord, Discord server, and we also have a Patreon account. So you can check those out and I'm going to wish you a great evening and uh, we are going to be talking tomorrow. I think it's Friday. So tomorrow Friday, we are going to talk about uh, Palantir again. And until then, I'm going to tell you à la prochaine.